Hi, this is Steve Gresham, founder of My $20 Travel Business, and today I'm going to teach you how to reactivate a suspended account. All right, so the first thing that happens is if you go to the website of a suspended account, like this one at the time, it says, this representative's website is suspended for non-payment. Please contact the representative and ask them to log in and pay or join with an active representative. And we have a text number if they need assistance. So what they can do is if it's your account, in this example, hope for you, you can actually click sign in and log in to your account. All right, and now we see that this account is suspended. And if we look over here, this is kind of interesting. This member here is a platinum member and it's suspended for non-payment. And you see here under the wallet snapshot, spent earnings $100. That means that $100 had been used to pay for a membership, but also paid earnings was 681. This is a member that had earned $681 they were paid Right now they have $35 in available payout funds, but they've been missing commissions because when you're suspended, you don't gain commissions. So they could have been making a lot more money, right? And then it has $56 reserve cash for memberships. All right, so this is somebody that definitely, they have a team, they definitely want to get back in. And they asked us, hey, I'm trying to pay, but I'm having an issue. So. Let me show you what you're supposed to do. The first thing that you do is you click on make payment and reactivate your account. Now that's gonna bring up the billing details and I can scroll up and right here it says, you know, your account is past due. Please click here to make a payment and keep your account status current. The issue is if you click here, it's got the old credit card in there. And so if you click submit payment, it's not gonna work because the old credit card is no longer valid. So we can click here, select payment method credit card. And at this point, we can put in the new information. Once we put in the new information, we can click submit and it should make the payment. Another option here is if we click on this, make payment and reactivate your account, then what we can do is click on update slash change payment method. Now we can select credit card and then we can go down and we can put in the new information and then we can click save update. So after we do that, we would be able to go in and click make payment or you could click pay right here. And it shows you the old card information. We need to click update change payment method credit card and then go put it in, click save update. Now you notice this says, if payment is due, this update will also charge the updated card, the amount due immediately. Otherwise, a $1 authorization will be placed on the card for validation. And I believe that that $1 authorization will not actually hit the account. It's just going to authorize it for $1. So that's how you do it. That's how you get reactivated and you start getting all your benefits and earning commissions if you have a team. Start earning commissions right away. Just make sure you have two personally referred members earn your monthly matrix commissions. Hope you enjoyed the training. Knowledge is power. Let's go help a million people get out of debt. Have a great day.